Hello everyone, in today's video I'm going to be going shopping at Scrooge McDuck's store. Hopefully everybody enjoys the video today. If you guys do, make sure you leave it a big Mickey thumbs up. I know I wore this dress in my last video uh, for shopping, but I'm just obsessed with it. It is Ariel's and uh, yeah, I just, I love the look so I, I couldn't change it. And I'm probably not changing it today either. But let's see what we've got. First up, we've got from Lilo and Stitch, the yellow beach chair. This goes for $1,200. I actually don't have this one. I have all the other colors, I think, but just that was the one I guess I was missing. Uh, next up, for $5.28, we have the black kitchen island. You know what? I'll go ahead and buy it. Why not? Then we have got for $13.20, the white marble coffee table. And I've got it, so I'm going to pass on that one. Over here, oh my gosh, it's new. The pink hair dryer. This is from Mickey and Friends. Actually, this belongs to Daisy specifically. And so does the hair bow, actually, that is on my character's head. So, yep, I think it actually looks really, really cute. Especially with uh, Ariel's dress. It matched so perfectly. I was so happy. I used it for my dream snaps last week, so... It was awesome. So 2400 for that. Uh, let me know in the comment section below if you guys would like to see me do a room tour for Daisy. I feel like soon I should have lots of stuff for her, so it could be quite cool. Uh, the Sword in the Stone. The book pile for eleven twenty-five. I'll pass on that. Then for 900 we have the Retro Fan from Ratatouille. And finally for 450 the Berry Bowl from Mickey and Friends. Until we go upstairs. I noticed the expensive pants aren't in here today, and no, I did not buy them. Just in case you were wondering, oh my gosh, they're gone. Nope. <gasps> Yay! For four eighty, we have the pink ice cream stand from Lilo and Stitch. I've seen this once before, and I passed it up for the Toy Story stars, and I'm so happy I did. But um, yeah, it's actually freaking in the store today. So yay! That's actually the last color that I needed. So that is awesome. Bye -bye. Then over, oh my gosh, you're joking. The Toy Story stars. Oh. What? What? Oh my gosh, I'm so rattled right now. The lavish pink double bed for $6.89. Oh, that just mind-blowing. From Encanto, the pink floral um, metallic bed. I own that. It's actually really cute really really cute oh, the toy story stars honestly like if anybody needed these i would have been like oh yeah come to my valley today but yeah it is getting quite late so this really really sucks oh my gosh okay so it's actually called the star-shaped neon decoration goes for four thousand they're super rare i spent like a year and a half trying to get those and i refreshed my store so many times it was crazy but they're actually here and it's so sad i'm walking away from them right now because i have so many actually purchased the chandelier from frozen for 5440 and uh yeah no wallpaper but we do have some stuff over on this wall i can't believe they're here <sighs> okay for 600 the blue double door glass top cover. This doesn't have any collection, but a lot of these items do not. This is from Tangled, the pub sign. <laughs> the Snuggly Duckling. And finally from Wreck-It Ralph for 6400 the Sugar Rush plushy shelf. It's a mouthful, but it is so cute. Actually, I put it in Boo's room as well that I did. Oh my god, my character's head is like inside the plushy what is happening okay let's leave that that is wild um but yeah those are actually so cute i've used them in vanellope's room and as i said uh booze and i've definitely used them in a couple of others as well maybe my toy story i think too i know i did a revamp of it like a little over a month ago so yeah i haven't been in there really since let's go actually in there and i will show you guys the toy story room because the toy story stars were in the shop so i feel like it is kind of appropriate Ooh, also too um i want to check my dream snaps right now um wait a second i was walking through the valley and bell da, da, da. okay so this is actually has nothing to do with that where where on earth is my where on earth is my dream snaps Um, they've changed a whole bunch of stuff. Where, where did my results come in? 
Here, let's let's have a look. Okay. Guess nothing yet. So, I guess nothing to check there. Mm, that's fine. We'll go, to, I guess, to the second floor. Wait, am I not supposed to have mood stones this week? No, it's got to go through the voting process first. Okay, that's my bad. I was away, so I keep thinking that, uh, yeah, this, this past week's but it has to go through the voting system. All right. I was like, what is happening? Okay. Uh, did I take them off the wall, first of all? I did. The plushies aren't up here. Um, Toy Story stars naturally are. And I put some posters up. I changed the wallpaper. Um, some of the style of the room is the same. And a lot of it's different. I don't love now how when you just go around, it doesn't, like... It just doesn't follow your character. And now it just shows all the stuff. It just makes the room look kind of junky. I'm not a fan of that feature. Ugh. Like, and I imagine for decorating and stuff too and showing it off. Super duper annoying. Uh, yeah, let me know in the comment section below what you guys think about that. Like, look at this. I can't even show off anything without... Ugh. Without it just, like, cutting into my frame. Which is, which is no fun. But this bed is super duper cute. Um, I know it isn't Toy Story, but I figured it is a toy. And it's cars, so why not have, uh, have some fun with it there. But I love this room. It looks fantastic. Even though the viewing of it right now needs to go back to the old way. Because it just looks like crap. But yeah, hopefully everybody enjoyed my video today. If you guys did, don't forget to leave it a big Mickey thumbs up. And I will see everybody for my next video. Bye.